Well, a Bay Area professor is now in the middle of the Russian controversy. He is the former U.S. ambassador to Russia. KPI X 5s Devin Feely on why Putin's government would love to interrogate him. Vladimir Putin doesn't like me. He doesn't like what I've written about him. He doesn't like what I say about him. So it came as no surprise when Vladimir Putin said this after his one-on-one -on -one meeting with President Trump. But it was the president's response that surprised and disappointed the former Russian ambassador and current Stanford University professor. Just lamentable, I think, is the, 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 my real reaction. Ambassador McFall says he's hired an attorney and is considering all his legal options, although the State Department now says it's highly unlikely they would ever turn over a current or former diplomat to a foreign government. I can't answer on behalf of the White House with regard to that, but what I can tell you is that the overall assertions that have come out of the Russian government are absolutely absurd. But just yesterday, White House spokesperson Sarah Huckabee Sanders sounded less sure of the administration's policy. Uh, the president also sees this as an opportunity, as he said many times, to be able to work with Russia. And that, Ambassador McFall says, could have a chilling effect on people considering a career in the foreign service. Service. He says he spent his life serving the country and hopes now it will do the same. My government, I hope, will step up today and categorically swat this back. And when I mean my government, I mean my president of the United States of America. Devin Feely, KPIX 5.